Larry Woody simply loves cars. The sounds, the smells. As an auto mechanic with his own shop, he loves working on cars. Just kind of feel everything, make sure it's good and tight. And even though a car accident on I-5 in 2002 took his sight. You learn to rely on your other senses a lot more. He still is able to do what he loves with a little help from his wife. The main thing he relies on for me is transportation. Um, a little bit of eyesight when he's working on something that he needs like wiring or real fine things. But most everything he does pretty much independently. Larry Woody may have lost his sight, but he hasn't lost his passion for cars or for racing them. Last Saturday at the Cottage Grove Speedway, Larry Woody got behind the wheel of Ray Hankey's number 49 modified. Here's your earpiece. Can you hear me now? That's the better. Okay, here's your helmet on your left. Steering wheel's up a right hand corner. With nice spotter Ernie Getting Owen left. talking him Hold through down. it. You're doing fine, nice and smooth. A little bit left, going a little hot. Woody successfully completed his two laps on the quarter mile track. Thanks, I want to shake your hand. I'll give you a hug. I'll Don't take that too. <laughs> to feel the, the car around you, to feel the power as a sighted person is an awesome feeling, but then to try to do it totally blind and having your life and, and control in somebody else's hands, it's a, it's a high. Surviving the Cottage Grove Speedway, Woody wants to inspire others with another amazing feat. I would like to find a car that would do excess of 200 miles an hour and go to Bonneville. Set the world speed record for a blind driver at uh, 200 plus miles an hour. Now that would be something to see. I'm Dirk Weishar in Cottage Grove.